This is Gene Key, KDD News. NewsChannel10.com reports a five-hour manhunt in Gray County ends without injury. The Sheriff's Department says they arrested 31-year-old James Dean Lee after he fled from them during a pursuit. It started in Shamrock around 8 Wednesday morning when they say he stole a truck from a motel. He was spotted a short time later and deputies pursued him into a canyon where he hid for five hours before surrendering. He was booked into the Gray County Jail for evading arrest in a motor vehicle. Also in Gray County, a Pampa man has been sentenced to prison for possessing child pornography. The 31st District Attorney's Office said Alex Fox was convicted on 10 charges of possession with intent to promote child pornography. The second-degree felony charges came from allegations in 2010. Fox was sentenced to 10 years for each charge. His sentence will run concurrently. The Associated Press reports from Houston, the Texas Court of Criminal Appeals has refused an appeal from a woman on death row for the 1996 robbery and slaying of an 80-year-old Amarillo man at his apartment. Brittany Hallberg argued test inside the wallet of victim A.B. Towery would show the absence of blood and fingerprints and tend to prove she was innocent of robbery and burglary, meaning she couldn't have been charged with capital murder. The appeals court Wednesday said no constitutional or legal provisions allowed her appeal. Hallberg, now 38 and identified in court documents as a prostitute, met Towery leaving a grocery store, got inside his place by asking to use his phone and then demanded money. Towery was hit with a hammer, stabbed 58 times and had a lamp pole jammed down his throat. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDD News.